Hey lifers, it's me, Jay. Um, it's Sunday. I said I wasn't gonna post today, but that doesn't mean I am not recording. I just want to tell you guys about yesterday at the time that I posted. Um, let me turn this air conditioner down. In my car, as you can see. I don't want that to be too loud. Anyway. At the time that I uh, posted yesterday, I didn't know what I was having for dinner or if I was going to choose a cheat meal. I did not choose a cheat meal. I ended up having um, blue crab, which was amazing. I already told y'all how much I love shellfish. <laughs> so that was great. Um, today, I did not cheat on my fast. I waited until one o'clock to eat. I did pick a cheat meal for lunch. I had Popeye's chicken, but like I told you guys, um, I still try and minimize my portions when I do cheat meals. So I chose one <laughs> chicken breast, <laughs> one chicken breast, and I had probably about the equivalent of half of an individual uh, side of red beans and rice. So I don't think that was too bad, um, considering it was supposed to be cheating. Uh, I know y'all see me fiddle with my hair a lot. You guys, I got this haircut back in February. And when I went to the shop, the lady who usually cut my hair did not work there anymore. And I was so irritated, but I thought, hey, she came out of this shop. Maybe other people are great here too. Mm -mm. Nope. This woman who cut my hair, like I realized halfway through she had no clue what what she was doing even though I had a picture and a video of the haircut that I wanted she said she knew how to do it and I let her do it now I'm not really that sensitive when it comes to my hair I mean it's hair it'll grow back you can bob it you can weave it you can braid it I mean you can do other things to cover up um a bad cut but this y'all this I've been hanging on to this little thing since uh February trying to grow it out <laughs> so it doesn't look like I got my head got run over by a darn lawnmower y'all mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I had braids in my hair and I'm about to go right back <laughs> right back to those braids um not just the haircut though it's kind of hard being a kinky curly girl and working out um and still trying to wear your hair straight it just it just it doesn't mix it doesn't mix all that sweat and all ugh. and I'm not I'm not a hair as you guys can see I'm not a hair and makeup type girl um, sometimes I'll have my hair done and sometimes you'll see me out here looking like who did it and why because I just like to do what I like to do <laughs> and I'm not out here for anybody else I'm out here for me and my husband doesn't mind so who cares what anybody else thinks? Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna go back to, to braids probably in a couple weeks. I wanted my hair to kind of rest and recharge from being cooped up in those braids for four and a half weeks. Maybe strengthen back up because I don't want to be out here with no edges, y'all. I do not want to be out here with no edges. Um... But anyway, that was my yesterday, and then uh, in my morning, or afternoon, I guess, today, it is, it's 2.42 now. I am actually sitting outside of the hospital. I don't know if you guys can see all that, but I'm sitting outside of the hospital. I'm about to go visit my mom and see how she's doing today, see if she's doing any better. Um, then I am going to head to Walmart and I'm going to pick up some things for dinner. The kids want nachos. My husband wants chimichangas. And I think I'm going to do a taco salad because we already have to make, um, we usually use turkey meat, not ground beef, but we already have to brown some turkey meat because he likes to add it to, uh, his, just to some chili and put on top of his chimichangas with cheese. Um, you guys seen that I already got the lettuce the other day. Sorry about that, yawn. I'm exhausted, y'all. <laughs> I'm so tired. I really just want to be at home curled up in a blanket watching an amazing movie and not being jumped on by what feels like 13,000 children, but it's really only three. Um, 
but I'm gonna go to the store and buy some things for uh, I think a taco salad I wanted nachos but I think maybe I'm gonna make that a taco salad just to make it a little healthier um, I won't have like the bowl or anything like that not the fried uh, tortilla shell just talk uh, salad with uh, taco seasoned ground turkey and some tomatoes and I don't know what else I don't know oh you guys remember I showed you guys that bitten strawberry dressing that I bought and I was so excited so excited that it was 50 calories per two tablespoons I shouldn't have been that excited y'all I probably should have tasted it first I mean when you first taste it you get the strawberries and it's also kind of savory a little bit salty if you ask me um, which is my thing you guys I love sweet and salty together I like when there's a bunch of flavor combinations I love that but but I don't know what they thickened it with. I guess I would have to look at the ingredients. But whatever they used to thicken it with, it just tastes so weird. I can't even really put my finger on it. It's almost like when people use too much cornstarch, that slurry or whatever it is that you make to thicken things with it. And they use too much and it almost tastes, I don't know, but gross. So like... At the beginning part of the bite it's really good you get the strawberry and you get kind of a salty savory um i don't know if i would say herby or whatever flavor but then like after you swallow it you almost get like that it's almost chalky like after you take like some pepto or something yeah, i don't know about that y'all but maybe i'm gonna try it again i'm not i don't like to waste money i don't um I also don't like to eat stuff I don't like so but I'm gonna give it another chance I'll try it again and if it's um I'll try maybe to use less maybe if I use because the flavor is pretty intense so maybe if I use less I'll get a little bit less of that that chalky kind of aftertaste I hope so because up front like it really does taste good and this really has the potential to be a really good dressing especially at 50 calories um, per two tablespoons um, that's way better than the ranch that I used to use and I don't like the fat-free ranch I know uh, my husband suggested that but I feel like it that has the same flavor it almost tastes like chalky glue or something how do I know what glue tastes like I went to elementary school I, I went to elementary school I ate glue yes yes I ate glue I know what glue tastes like. Y'all know what glue tastes like. Y'all done had some Elmer's. Stop playing with me. Y'all had some Elmer's. Some of y'all probably still munching on it. I've seen them strange addictions out there. Mm -hmm. But anywho, those are, that's my uh, plan for dinner and that's what I had for lunch um i told you guys i usually don't work out on weekends i did my workout yesterday like i said because i cheated and ate that pizza i'm still kind of bitter about that pizza but that's all right i'm gonna learn to let go i'm gonna learn to let go <laughs> um but no workout for today um nothing formal anyway my husband and i are gonna go play in the backyard a little bit with some water with the kids i don't know if we can do the pool you guys i went to go i stretched the pool all out into the backyard and i went to go blow it up and i noticed there was a hole there was a tear in the little ring that goes around the top of the pool so I don't know what I'm going to do. I know that it came with a patch, but ask me if I know where that patch is at. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to try and find it. I'll try and look for that patch and maybe we can patch it up and get some air in it and um, fill it up. Otherwise, maybe I'll just spritz them with the water hose. They're young. They don't care. I, I, I turn the water hose towards the sky and I tell them it's raining and they think it's absolutely hilarious. This is the fun age when you can just kind of do anything with them and it's fun. 
um, and as long as you're playing with them, they just don't care. They don't care at all. So um, either way, we're going to do something in the backyard. It's hot again today. It's um, going to be 95 degrees with the heat index of 100, 101. Um, later on in the week, it's probably it's supposed to be um, a true air temperature of 100 degrees. So we're going to have to find things <laughs> that are cool to do because... I don't like the heat y'all I do not like the heat I can tolerate it as long as we're doing like water type things um because of course that cools you off but I, I don't like the heat like at all so anyway those are my plans for today um I hope that you all are doing something that is working towards your goals today um make a good decision make a good choice even one time if you skip a fast food or close that chip bag before you were done eating or pass up on that candy bar say no to that ice cream get up and take a walk around the block um, whatever it is just do something today to accomplish your goals whatever you have set in mind for your, yourself um, I'm gonna go see my mama and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow I want to get you guys a clip of some of the, um, I guess you would call it strength training type workouts that I do at home. Um, hopefully I can record some of that for you guys tomorrow and include that with the vlog. But anyway, adios lifers.